Welcome, Wastelanders, to... This is it. This is the end. We have done. And Wake Remastered. Two big parts. Previous part was big. This part is big. It just, it just came out that way. Just the, the way I recorded it was easier. So, and also, Merry Christmas. Because this is coming out as it should plan to be on Christmas. But if you're watching this after Christmas or before Christmas or later on or past future then welcome to Alloway Remastered. This is the final part. I am going to heads up discuss pretty much straight away my feeling of the shortcomings in this game and then obviously later on towards the end I'll give my sort of overall opinion of this game which is highs and lows like I've said it before I say it again I'm gonna say it again it's definitely you know the driving the running it is a 20 10 game but does it hold up that's the thing 13 years later with release of a second one does it hold up that's what we're gonna find out so if you like this video please like and subscribe and comment down below and let's just jump into the ending of Alan Wake Remastered alone in daylight Surrounded by the beauty of the Pacific Northwest West. Hey, I got flashbangs. It was hard not to let doubt creep in one last time. I could still chalk everything up to a dream, a delusion. I had enough imagination to make up something like this, having been in the cabin all this time, trapped in a story inside my head, gone mad from grief over Alice's death like Hartman had claimed. There would be no way of knowing. I told myself it didn't really matter. My course was set. Oh no. Please no more driving. I don't wanna drive. I hate driving in this game. Oh, it's like the worst part of this game is driving. Running and driving. Wow. So if we're on the end now then. I went through the tunnel, there's nothing there. So if we're at the end now then. Hmm. It's sort of the time then we sit down and sort of think about the game. I love the story. I think it's so good. Told you, big Twin Peaks vibes. The setting, Twin Peaks. I love it. Love it so much. A lot of, I think I read somewhere, now, um, I don't know if I've said it already. A lot of stuff is based in the Pacific Northwest because of Twin Peaks in the 90s. 1989, I think, come out. And then 1990 and 1901. But, anything here? But yeah, if we're on the end now. There's certain things I don't like, but then again, this is a 13 year old game, you know? So, like the first one come out in 20, this come out in 2010, originally. And the remaster's just, they changed Alan's face. Ooh, thank you. They changed Alan's face to match the real life actor, because it wasn't, because I didn't know this, but the Alan's wake, Alan, Alan, Alan's voice, is not the actor's voice. The actor is someone else. Which I never knew, which I find very strange. It seems like how like originally wasn't it like Sam Lake played Max Payne, but the voice of Max Payne was someone else, so so they changed it. But anyway, any hills, uh yeah, so they did that, they changed that, didn't really do much other than that without reading. To see, you know, I'm not and got. I have got my phone, but you, you know, you know, oh, I will take the hunting rifle. Thank you. Yeah, without looking, I think that's all off top of memory that they've changed. Oh, I can go this way, can I? Oh, it's a little cabin. Oh, well, uh, thank you. That's pretty cool. I can't tell if it's marked because I don't have my thing. Mid touch. I don't have my torch. So I don't know. Okay, well, I didn't find anything else, so. But, um, as I was saying, because I had stopped it, because. Uh, yeah, this this game's good. I enjoyed the story. I enjoyed the story quite a lot. The remaster is a remaster, is what it is. It's not Resident Evil 4 remake. It's not Resident Evil 2 remake, or even, um, I'm trying to think like Medieval or something like that. It's, it's a remaster. So it's upgrade graphics, probably runs at 60 FPS when it didn't. They changed the actor's face, and it's pretty much it if memory serves but i enjoy it like like i said before already own this game on xbox i i have no idea where it is though 
I, I, I think all my Xbox games are in storage, or Xbox 360, sorry. All my Xbox 360 games are in storage. I have like my Xbox One games offhand, but that's it. I think, I think every other Xbox game is in storage because Xbox Game Pass. So I don't, I don't even, ha I don't own Xbox. So I can play them on PC. Anyway, anywho, <laughs> I keep saying that today. Uh, yeah, oh, I'm dead. Oh, ri really? Okay, we're back here. Uh, it put me back too far. I'm like, I'm not going to get that shit. I'm not getting a hunting rifle. I can get this because it's here. I've got to come this way. I think. I think. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. Yeah. Am I supposed to go this way? Yeah. Because it did my checkpoint. Huh. Yes, I got the Femis, and that was it. I didn't get the rifle, so I've still just got the normal stuff. I'm. Oh. Oh shit. I will kill your wife. She's changed it. Oh. Why is she changing? At least I've still got the handheld, you know? Um I keep I keep I keep getting distracted, so I'm not talking about what I want to talk about. So yes, driving, terrible. Hate it. So much in this game. Could have done without it. Didn't need to drive in sections at all. You could have literally just done a little cutscene and it would have been fine. Um the running is probably the biggest issue other than that the game itself runs fine i've had no problems sometimes when there's a cutscene you get like when we had the helicopter you get like the um dip in frame rate but this game is a 2010 game and it feels like a 2010 game it's the same thing when i said uh, evil within like it, it this feels like no different to when i first played it i think 2010 or 2011 when i bought it for xbox 360 it feels no different Apart from it runs probably native at 1080p and runs at 60 FPS, for all that I know. But yeah, the driving sucks. One of the worst drivings I've ever had in a game. The running, terrible. And what I find really sort of frustrating, I think it's because, uh, I wouldn't say this is the third, first to do it, but there's no upgrade system. Rifle, literally, second you first get the rifle to even now. One hit carriers, enemies, two hit carriers, big boys. Pistol, what, three? It's like three hits, isn't it? Not changed, no upgrade system. Yes, they've got the different battery torches and stuff, but other than that, there's not really an upgrade system. Like I said before, with the, um, I'm not a surgeon for anything, because dri dri driving's terrible in this game. Like I said before as well, like certain points where, oh look, the Majestic. For some reason, you cut a scene and I've lost all my shit. Like, really? Surely you can add in a, um, inventory system that stays the same no but they're the only little things other than that it's a very enjoyable game i enjoy it i'm having fun based on the signature in the motel register agent nightingale had stayed here in room number two yeah i, I had fun i'm not i'm not gonna front it Majest Majestic Motel, general information, refundable 100 security deposits required on all reservations, no personal checks ex accepted, we take all major credit cards and bank cards, check out times 10am, no loud music, no pets. One vehicle per unit, facilities are for registered guests only, no visitors allowed on premises after 9pm, no exceptions. We hope you enjoy your stay at a Majestic and if you're a senior or a vet, ask for about our discount. Hey. Uh, yeah, I enjoy my game. I've had fun with this game. Um, I love it. I knew I liked it when I first played it. But I didn't like so I just, just didn't get that far. I don't know why. Some stuff you just don't know. Same thing with Evil Within when I first played it. I, uh... Several times I got to a certain point. I just don't know why. It's just sometimes it gets in the way. Other games come out. We don't know, do you? You don't, you don't really know these things. But I'm happy I've done it now. Oh, well, we'll be doing it. We're at the end now. I presume we're on the end.
We're in the end game now. So. Oh. Uh, oh my god. Whoa. Is this guy obsessed with. What the. Jesus. This had obviously been the room where Agent Nightingale had stayed when he hadn't been busy harassing me. What happened to him? Ooh, flashbacks. Ooh. Look at yourself, that guy below. Jump in. There's that one over there as well. Yeah, I enjoy my game. Okay. I'm enjoying this game. I think people should play it. I do think... Um, I don't think they've left it too long. I think they did, did the right thing in leaving it for a bit. Because they brought out, like, American... Um, Anna Wake, American Nightmare. Ellen Wake's American Nightmare. Which is... Um, I've never played it. But... Apparently you fight a doppelganger of Scratch, I think it's called Scratch, his doppelganger. Which probably spoiled myself for the end of this game, but I'm not focused on it too much, I'm just having fun. Carney. wonder what that means. Yeah. I'm having fun. Considering as well, like, this game's, like, free on PlayStation Plus. I assume it's free on Game Pass? I, I haven't looked. So, you got really... You got for some free time, fancy a cheeky little horror game? It's not really scary. It's a few times things scare me. Like I said before, the, um, the whisper in the caves, that really fuck, freaked me the hell out. Another level, that. Oof. That sent chills down, man. Spam. I was like, I'm not going to search. Continues to search. Okay. Now what are we? Oh! Okay. Man, she's be blocking the road at every chance she gets. He's like, you ain't going cold in the lake, Mr. Wake. I ain't gonna let you. I ain't gonna let you. I'll go across the bridge myself. I think so. Can't see any thermos, can't see any pages. Oh. This does not look at Taz in. I don't know what that is. Okay, nope, can't go up there. But yeah, it's an enjoyable game. I mean, if you like horror and stuff, more of a thriller than a horror. The story is good though. Right, I like the story. In this game. I do the different things like you know, the fact they're like, oh, it's a writer, and then with Thomas Zane, and now with this clicker thing, that I, you know, makes me think, oh, what the hell? Makes me know Tom Zane might be. What the hell? Yep, you said. Tom Zane might be Alan's daddy. He's a baby daddy. Don't be hitting me. Fridge. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Ow. Ow. Dad, dad. Yeah, the checkpoints would be weird as well. Checkpoints are my favorite thing in this game. Well, I like to move the hell away from that. Nope. 
fucking gave me, but... Really? What? Man, why? Why can't this just be a cutscene? I'm I'm stuck on something. What the hell? Ah, oh, this driving sucks. Oh look, they're going their own little car. It's like a monster truck. That's so cool. Wouldn't there be lights in it though? No? Yeah. There we go. Jesus Christ. What's in it? What car? I don't like here's a checkpoint. Use it. No, okay. What if you're upstairs? A single flare. Oh, it's a power company as well. I don't need to hear everyone. Oh, God. Bus. Oh my god. Oh, my, oh that's unfair. Okay, so we're back here now. No, hop on the magic school bus. Really? 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 Damn this game. Oh my god, this game's gonna be death for me. I hate driving in this game. Totally crappy. I don't think I'm supposed to take this car. I'm supposed to take this one? No. Ooh, flares. Yeah, there's a lot of goopity goop. What modern camping equipment is lightweight? Present. Oh, it's weird. It didn't really make a noise. I'm signing a light with him.
god. I forgot I had a shotgun. Ah! Oh my god. Come on. God. Stupid ass shadows. Hey, two for one. So we haven't got ready. Oh, I missed one. Oh, I didn't read it. Episode six, Departed. Okay. Uh, the Dark Present wants to stop Wake. The Dark Presence was no longer trying to capture the writer so he could create the ending it wanted. The writer knew too much. He was too strong. And he carried a weapon left behind by Thomas Zane. Something that could hurt it. Now, the darkness was doing everything in its power to simply stop the writer from ever reaching Cauldron Lake and the dark place it came from. Hmm. Definitely trying to stop. Oh, there's a lot of nightmare ones on this. Wow. The bottom of Cauldron Lake was a graveyard of things the lake had claimed in one way or another over the decades. The dark presence brought them up in its wake, scattering the rotten waterlogged hull of an old boat here, the remains of a long ago crashed airplane there, trees shattered under the impacts, the earth groaned. It didn't even notice. Mm. Sun spew crap up. We got batteries and revolver ammo, which I have loads of. Ah, oh, make more driving. Oh my god. Okay. Searching this game, like we found early on, is quite terrible when it comes to the driving sequences. Ugh. Okay, what we got here then? Nothing. Car. Checkpoint. Okay, so it's this way. I searched around here, there's nothing. Nothing there. Oh! I had a feeling they were going to come out. That's why I sort of was like, okay, let me. Let's, uh. Let's get. Go up to it and turn around, shall we? I'm going there. What's in here Yeah. Is that it? One dude. All visitors must see the yard manager. You must sign a li liability waiver before entering the yard. If you're looking for a specific part, ask for first. Ask for it first. For you pull it, you must bring your own tools. Wear protective clothing. Warning: jump piles may shift hazardous area. Okay. I'm okay with it. Where we go then? Yeah, give me that hunting rifle. Thank you. There you go. Mm, I thought I heard something. Batteries, batteries. I take you. Batteries, 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 batteries. I take you. Okay, let's go upstairs. Oh, I'll probably have to do this then. Yeah. Hello. I still hear people. Oh, 
I heard you. Oh, it switched guns. I thought I did this one. It's fine. Ain't nobody coming up there anytime soon now. Is that it? I think so. Oh, Kansas. Oh, joy of it, Jesus. We don't need to stop. Huzzah! Yeah. I hate driving in this game. With a passion. Ugh. Ooh, a page. Thomas Zane's last dive. Zane cut its heart out, but it didn't die. The thing that wore Barbara's face kept crooning sweet nothings sugar-laced with poison. He put on the suit, untied the monster from the chair. The thing in his arms thrashed weakly, but he held fast. He stepped outside, off the pier, and into the dark water, a sinking pinprick of light descending toward a bottom that never came. What? Okay. I, I don't get that one. Oh, what, another bulldozer. Flashbang. There we go. Oh, mate. Flashbang. Come on. Come on. Well, I can keep it under that. I'm always skeptical of areas like this. Why even have it in it if it's not gonna do nothing with it? Maybe it's a nightmare page, you know? Oh well. Damn it. Another checkpoint. Another old house building. When I told Barry my plan back in the well-lit room, I'd acted as if I knew what I was doing. I didn't. I was operating on the shifting logic of a dream. I had to fight my way to the lake through the horrors of the night. I had to flick an old battered light switch imbued with childhood magic. I had to write a happy ending to a horror story. I had to save my wife from the dark prison she was being held in. Hmm. Follow. Ominous noise. Follow. I want berries. Oh, I've probably reached one of them. Oh, what was that? Nothing. Oh. Wow, such a weird mechanic right at the end of the game.
No, no one else doing that? So weird. Okay, why do I need lights? Well. Oh. I'm okay. I'll take the flashbangs. I'll come back if I run out of ammo. Hello? Housekeeping. I will never give her to you. Who? Oh. What the? Farmers are the opposite hunters. Ow! Lights, lights, lights. I see you, big man. I thought Oh What we got? The rover? Hunter rifle Did I go in here? I don't think so I think we just go and make it to our light source. I don't care about a chainsaw man. Okay, let's put me all the way back here. Stupid, but whatever. Okay. Fine. I'm back here then. Come on. Oh, I touched it. Oof. Oh. I did not want to do that all over again. For the second time. Yeah, I didn't really use this. It sort of, they... I like, made a beeline for it. So they sort of just ran with me. Oh, come on. Oh, God. Jump. Yeah, bastard. Here we go. 
And there's another one. Oh, oh manuscript. Go. Huh? What? Okay. The dark place. The dark place I found myself in was unlike anything I could ever have imagined. It wasn't solid. It flowed. It was conceptual and subjective. For someone else, an artist in another field, it would have been very different. I could sense the story of the manuscript all around me. The words and ideas floating in the air, poised to become real. Yeah, I'd... I haven't got the last couple manuscripts. Same with that one. Okay, I understand he's in the dark place, but... Okay. They said Thomas Zane jumped in there. I think that's what they're trying to say. I don't know. I could be wrong, but I think that's what they're trying to say. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'm wasting my hundred rifle bullets on some two bit taken man without a chainsaw. I only deal with chainsaw mains. I could see Mirror Peak in the distance. That's where Cauldron Lake was. Oh god. We're gonna have to drive there. I hope not. Oh, flares. There you go. Don't need that, don't need that. I take the fa the fa the flares though. Oh wait, yeah, my truck. Minecart, mine truck, mine truck, minecart, minecart, minecart. I see bullets. I've got 13 of these motherfuckers. Come at me, bro. Cool. Oh. Okay. Don't take... Oh. Really? I'm like, where are they? There you go. Off with you. I don't know. There's a checkpoint now. I'm going to go down there quick. Oh. Oh, no. No. Oh, I could have climbed up that way. What's down here then? Oh, no, let's get... no, no, no. We're not getting ahead of ourselves. Checkpoint. Yeah. Take the checkpoint. Have a nose. Try not to die. That's good. Uh... I might, if I don't get any hunting rifle ammo in this, I might have to take the shotgun. Yeah, I'm going to have to take the shotgun. I ain't got enough ammo. I do prefer the hunting rifle, but I haven't got ammo. I haven't got any ammo. So it is what it is. At least I've done the pushy bit, so I can just jump, you know. There we go. Yeah, I'll say, come on, back, 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 you come. That's what I thought. Ugh. Where now? There's too many. Too many.
just appear out of nowhere. It's all good. Keeping a watch out. You better not come for me. Ow. Oh, it's this. Man's got a shovel or a spade. Yep, my shooting was not the best in that situation. There we go. No more troubles. Check up points. Okay, that was weird. What about the flare? Am I reached on flare ammo? Hell yeah, I'm using flare gun then. Man's reached the lemmat. Trucker. I sure don't need ammo. I don't think I'm stacked, my guys. I heard you, buddy. Well, Damn. yeah. Oh, no, I thought I had this. Oh, no. I hate the speedy man's. Worst enemy in the game. There we go. That dude went more! Come on. Face me like a man. Oh, really? Hey. Thank you for the checkpoint. Okay. Let's take stock. We like this. Uh, flashbangs, that's reloaded. There we go, okay. Whew. This way. Ooh, a plane. Or propeller. There's a boat part. I still hear that guy like popping off. Yeah, mate. It's what fucking fool.
Who's next then, eh? Come on. Who's next? What's a piece of me? Oh, come on. Wow, the flash frames don't really work well with these guys. I hate these guys so much. Don't follow me. Oh. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Stupid game. Assholes. I hate them enemies, man. Probably a good idea when it first came out, but not now. Wait a minute, where am I going to go? Oh. Up there. Yep. Probably should be. Really? Go away. Oh. Go away. I got front stuff being thrown at me, man. I don't want to deal with you. And there's another one. I hate him so much. Yeah. Jesus. It's because they like speed about and that. So it's hard to like do anything. Oh my god, fat wake. It's hard to do anything. <laughs> Nearly again. These two checkpoints are generous in this last part. I don't think I have to worry about the checkpoints. Ooh. Another, how many high holes she's got? Flare gun again, man. Maybe using that flare gun then. The darkness. Where's her face? I don't believe you. Only joking. Of course that does. What's this? Pumpy? Nah. What have I got? Yeah, I've got Pumpy. Yeah. Oh. He's got a Pumpy. Boy. Boy. Don't need that. I, oh, I was gonna say I, I'll take the lithium batteries, but also I don't need it. Examine. I needed to get the generator running. But they're like broken. Oh, 
Oh, stop. Look. Go. Go us. What's this? Flare gun ammo. Ooh, flashbangs. There we go. Really? Where are you? Oh. Ducky, speed him and Gonzalez. I don't have time for your bullshit. What? What did I do? Did you fall that push me? If I didn't push me so far, that's so weird. Oh, nice good page. Did I miss one? No. The way through the dark place. After Zane had gone, I stood alone in the shifting dream that was the dark place. I had to find a way to the cabin. I had written myself a way through this place in the manuscript. I followed the idea of a path. I had written myself across the ocean that blocked my way, and with that, there was a bridge to the island beyond. The idea of the cabin flickered in the underwater darkness. I willed the cabin to be real, and it was. Okay. So basically, we go to the darkness, we find Thomas Zane. He disappears. Turn back now. No. Oh. oh. Flashbang. Uh flagger. Flagger gonna get. Number one. And keep it going. Hell yeah. There's still sounds like there's enemies here though. Fuck it. Scarecrow. Oh. Ow. Well, hit me. Go away. Oh my god. Oh. You can't get me now. I'm coming, Alice. I'm gonna save you. Me and my fatness. Eh. You can't win. 
Yeah, I've got flare guns for days. Booyah! Booyah! Keep firing. I like got I think I've got unlimited ammo. Oh, oh. It's just top up on the old flare. No. Burst it, come on. Come on. Hell yeah. Tornado Wrangler. Okay. So is this the dark place? Mate, what are you doing? Man be T-posing. Shh, baby. You were having a bad dream. Just covered in water. It was just another nightmare. No. Everything's fine. You're home. It wasn't a dream. Everything's fine. Ugh. Turn the lights on. Turn the lights on. Shh, baby. The power's out. There's no light. Come back to bed and I'll make you forget all about your fear, darling. I bet you were looking like that. It's your fear. Why aren't you afraid? You're not Alice. Turn the lights on now. Where's the clicker? What did you do with it? In the buff room. No. Have you taken your pills? You want me oh, to Oh, fucking hell, she teleported. <gasps> That's type of I read your manuscript. It's brilliant. Departure is your best work yet. You're a genius. I'm so proud of you. Come back to bed. We'll talk more about it in the morning. No. You're not my Alice. Coffee? Clicker. Come back to bed, Alan. Oh. Come back to bed, Tom. Hell. To the air. There he is. You must find your way to the cabin. It stands in your way. Why has he got a hook for hands? Just Captain Hook. There it is. Bird. Thermos. <laughs> Shopping cart. Barrel phone. 
barrel. Oh, look, I'm writing. Oh, can't pick up. I followed the idea of a path. Oh. Okay. Oh, shoebox. I'm leaving you. What? I'm leaving you, Ella. I met someone. I'm in love with someone else. No, what? she ain't. No, what are you saying? You can't. You don't love me. How could you? You don't even love yourself. All you do is torture yourself with work you can't do anymore. No, I love you more than anything in the world. You're, you're my muse. Who are you? What have you done with my Alice? Hello? I had written myself across the ocean. But You're not my dog. I promised to be good. Please, I'm tiny, you naughty boy. Oh. I will help you out your master. I will love you forever. No, you're not dog or jagger. I made a terrible mistake. I should have never written you back. You came back wrong. Your heart is filled with darkness. Put that knife away, Thomas. Put it down. My heart is filled with darkness. Cut it out. Take you back to the depths you came from. Yeah, Thomas Saint sounds like me. and refused to do as he was told. All he had to do was write what I wanted him to write. Now Here we go. Ooh, the rocking horse. There she is. Yeah, she ain't got no hole. I mean, no, she's got a hole in her heart. Never get her back. Ooh. I am much older than you. Older than your first work of art. I will find a new face to wear. Uh, someone else to dream me free. Hey, yo. Uh... There it is. Lights are on. All he's got to do is finish any. She's got right at the end. Like a few hours as presence close by. The owls. What I had to do now. Fire, walk with me. Write the ending to departure. There's light and there's darkness. Cause and effect. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything has a price. That's where Zane had gone wrong. Yeah. There's a long journey through the night back into the light. So this is where we started. Oh, no. Yeah, then he jumped in, didn't he? So that's probably where he was taken. Because he missed a week, didn't he?
Is that animated or a real person? It might be animated actually. Okay. Really? Is that where they're going to end this? Dear first. Pat, Doctor. Who's that? Sheriff. Tor and Odin. Rose? Is that Nightingale in the back? It's not a lake. It's an ocean. Alan, wake up. Whoa! Wow. I'll turn the music down so we can't hear it. I oh know, it's kicking in now. Wow. So, it's not a lake, it's an ocean. So Alan just trapped them, basically. And, um, like you said, it was such a throwaway line, wasn't it? Oh, fuck. This is going to fuck me over. It's a very good song. I'll probably mute it by now. I've muted it, probably post but uh it's uh david bowie ground, ground control to major tom i think it's called like starship something or other. it's a very good song yeah space oddity is, is the song okay let's give it wow holy shit can do nightmare now holy shit Statistics, yes please. Kills a revolver, 205, flare gun, 108, shotgun, heart and rifle, flashbangs, yeah, vehicle, indirect kills, poltergeist items destroyed, birds killed 802, okay, batteries used, manuscript fades, 89 out of 106, oh mate, oh and you've missed 8 thermos, hell yeah, camper is knocked over, oh halfway, 6 out of 12, it's not too bad, just found, oh and you missed 3, radios, shows found, all of them, TVs found, all of them. Signs found. 14 out of 25. Okay. Alarm cocks found. Cardboard standees found. Nice springs video games. What the hell are they? Maybe it's um a nightmare thing, man. Can we do all of them now? Oh, yeah, you can select so you know. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That is... Is that really how they ended it, like, 13 years ago? No wonder people are cramming for, like, another one. Wow. So, that's such a throwaway line, because 
I think, if I remember rightly, Alan, is it called Alan Wake American Nightmare? I ain't got my phone on me. Yeah, so Alan Wake Night, it's called Alan Wake's American Nightmare. So it's on Xbox 360, was released um, two years after the original, so 2012. So Alan Wake's American Nightmare result revolves around the titular Alan Wake, a former best-selling author of crime fiction. During a vacation on, in the small town of Wright Falls, Washington, Alan encounters a supernatural entity known as the Dark Presence, which has forced him to write the manuscript of, horror, of a horror novel which would give him the power by turning the events of the story into reality. This occurred through the power of the Dark Place, a subjective alternative dimension located beneath okay, the vol volcanic cauldron lake near Bright Falls. Alan was ultimately able to defeat the Dark Presence by altering the ending of the manuscript, freeing Bright Falls and destroying the dark presence but trapping alan within the dark place that's what we saw because when we said then he said like um it's not a lake it's an ocean uh alan wakes america now focuses on mr scratch okay yeah double, yeah i was i was right double gang of alan Wake created by a power of cauldron lake doing the events of the game is real that mr scratch was created when false rumors spread of alan wake following his disappearance the power of the dark place turned this misinformation to reality in the form of mr scratch uh, okay like she said you can get rid of me but i will just take another face so he basically the dark presence took alan's face in the form of mr scratch basically six okay look the game takes place in night springs official town brought by life by alan wake's writings within the town alan encounters several denizens who aid him in his mission to stop the scratch, including the auto mechanic Emma Salone, astronomer Dr. Rachel Meadows, and art curator Serena Beldiva. Other characters who make cameras in the game include Anne's friend Agent Barry and the Anderson brothers. Heavy metal band music from the Bright Falls, who aided Alan doing events the first game. And Barry now manages, okay, that's, that's pretty cool. He manages them now on their combat tour. That's cool. Yeah, so it's American Nightmares based in a fictional. TV show of Night Springs, which we watched, follows and basically start of Twilight Zone. Blah, 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 blah. I'm just reading it quickly because I, I won't play it. Okay, so basically, yeah, so we go at the end of American Nightmare. I don't know what it says the third time, so repeats him for the third time, but it's able to save Emma and Rachel, who are the other two people in it. He sets the correct series of events into the prediction room, which triggers the projector. So, a fan, a film made by Alice, Mr. Scratch appears again, but discovers Alec has Alan has successfully written a new reality and he is blurred out of existence by the film on the on film on screen. On the screen, Alan appears to be not Alice along a sunlit storyline. However, narrative challenges whether this event actually occurred or merely a figment of Alan's imagination. Now, for what trailers I have watched of Alan Wake 2, this proves it is Alan's animation because he is still stuck trapped in Dark Place. And I think I did watch one trailer and it was like, oh, uh, you've been trapped in there for 13 years and now you're, now you're back. So it's like, oh, okay. In the post credit scene of American Nightmare, Barry wakes up suddenly believing he has heard Alan's voice. Okay. Yeah. So it's good. I enjoyed it. I very much enjoyed it. The ending, I can understand why people were cramming at like fucking frothing at the mouth for another one because it does leave you on such a big cliffhanger of like, did he get out or didn't he get out? Which we now learn he didn't. He didn't get out. He stayed. It's like Thomas Zane did because he did this, exactly the same thing. That just that throwaway line of just like oh this is Mr. Scratch he he will see your friends later you're like what like <laughs> and he's like the main villain of the the it's not a sequel game but it's expanding it's, it they say it's expanding the universe of Alan Wake that's so weird it's, it's like a throwaway line it's, it's so weird and obviously yeah so Thomas Zane stayed and so did Alan because they someone has to stay in what I don't know manage the dark presence I don't know because she did it Cynthia Weaver did it for what since the 70s. Which makes me think that Thomas Zane might be Alan Wake's dad. I don't know if anyone has said that before. I don't want to Google it and spoil myself, so I'm not going to, because I haven't played Alan Wake 2. I've only, like I said, I've only watched like two trailers for it. What well, the ori the original like announcement, and then one they released earlier this year. But yes, I enjoyed this game. It was good. I was going to play it regardless, but I thought I'd do a little Christ at Christmas. I thought I'd do a little uh, Shocktober thing, but like, oh look, Shocktober. Uh, it worked out, sort of. Uh, not really, same time, because obviously it's now, like I said, 28th of November, about to hit Christmas, and I've just finished it now. I enjoyed that, hopefully you enjoyed that. Let me know in the comments below if you've played Alan Wake 2 or Control, and what what is your thought on it. We're going to end it here, close the book, pencil down, and leave it in this wonderful cliffhanger that is Alan Wake Remastered. If you enjoyed it, please like, and if you want to see more from me, 
and more of the Shocktober and Shocktober Encore, which is the Evil Vin, please uh, click the link wherever it's going to be. So yes, thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.